Hello and welcome to the question on indefinite integration. Uh, this is one of the important questions. Evaluate e to the power tan inverse of x 1 plus x plus x squared dx upon 1 plus x squared. Now if we see the question, the question clearly demands the substitution of tan inverse of x. So we should be putting tan inverse of x is equal to t because its derivative is present in the uh, denominator if you can see. So we are putting tan inverse x is equal to t and differentiating it with respect to t and this is dt by dx so in terms dx upon 1 plus x square is dx. Now what is x? x is tan t. So now with these terms we substitute and this becomes e to the power t. One remains as it is. x becomes tan t. x square becomes tan square t dt and the entire of dx over 1 plus square now is dt. Now the next thing is to collect 1 plus tan square t. Why we are collecting 1 plus tan square t? Because 1 plus tan square t will be secant square t and the integration of secant square t is tan t and the derivative of tan t is secant square t. So you can see a strong connection between the two. So I'm writing 1 plus tan square t as secant square t and the other part remains as it is. Now you can see that if we proceed the second part, that is this part, then we can have the derivative and we can have the exact integration on the other side. So we have e to the power t secant square t dt and e t tan t so we'll be applying by parts in this part using or applying by parts by taking tan t as first function and e to the power t as second function so the first part remains the same and we apply by parts in this so first function tan t as it is integration of ed is ed minus the whole integration of derivative of tan t is secant square t dt and the integration of et is et just see this is negative of this so we can cancel this and our answer is e to the power t tan t plus c now, sometimes what happens, we go very excited and we leave the answer like this. So examiner can cut marks because the original variable is x. So do not forget to put answer in terms of x. Do you remember that t is tan inverse of x and tan t is x? So what is the answer? The answer is e to the power tan inverse x into x plus c. But this expression looks good. So the answer is x into e to the power tan inverse of x plus c. Thank you very much.